Former NFL player Marcus Holliday is begging for a ceasefire in his hometown of Memphis, Tennessee, after Big Jook. The older brother of Memphis rapper Yo Gotti was gunned down at a repass for a loved one. As we previously reported, Yo Gotti's brother, Big Jook, born Anthony Mims, was shot and killed on Saturday, January 13. Fox 13 Memphis reported that several police sources confirmed to them that Juk was gunned down at a repass following a funeral. According to Memphis Police Department officials, one man was killed and another man was injured. Outside of Perignon's restaurant and event center on the 6300 block of Winchester Road, police said they arrived at the scene around for 15 p.m. local time and that one man was rushed to STT. Francis Hospital, where he later died. The second man arrived at STT. Francis Hospital by private vehicle and was listed in critical condition. Police said they believe that the two men were targeted in the shooting. At the time of publishing, the exact details of the shooting are unclear. Officials also reported that they have surveillance footage of the shooting, but have not yet been able to identify the suspect. It was reported that Juk had just finished attending a funeral service and was at the event center for a repast for a fallen relative. Social media was flooded with tons of photos and videos purportedly showing Juk bleeding out on the ground after being gunned down. Juk was super close to his younger brother, Yogati, and was officially affiliated with his label Collective Music Group, helping out a lot on the back end with the business. Juk played a big role in promoting artists under CMG and even appeared in a few music videos for the artists as well. Following the passing of Big Juk, ex-NFL player and Memphis native Marcus Halle, a, a doc, took to his Instagram and called for a ceasefire in his hometown. He uploaded a video captioned, Memphis, can we stop? In the two-minute clip, he said, I, this for my brothers in the streets in Memphis. I man, seriously, can we stop? Can we stop? Please can we stop? I'm serious. I pray to the Most High, God, can we stop? All this killing, all this shooting, all this stealing, all this robbing? Can we stop? Holidayids now just heard that someone we all know just got shot and killed. Just got the call from my partners in the streets. Seriously, I mean, I pray to the Most High God all the time. But can we stop? I don't know who's going to hear this. But I talked to my cousins. I talked to my partners. I talked to my nephews. I talked to my people who still in the streets. And my people who used to be in the streets, who no longer in the streets. And we have these conversations trying to see what can we do. But can we stop? Seriously? Marcus Holiday continues. I know this has been simmering since young Dolph tragically lost his life, and before then. But we got to have a truce, man. We got to. Whoever needs to come to the table and talk, please come to the table and talk. I'm serious, man. This is my hometown. I'm from the inner city. I came from the same kind of troubles and challenges. And put myself in a lot of situations when I was younger shouldn't have been in. But please, can we stop? I'm serious, man. All praises to the Most High. The post-former NFL player Marcus Holliday begs for ceasefire in Memphis after Yo Gotti's big brother, Big Juk, is gunned down at loved ones. Repass appeared first on Hollywood Unlocked.